Female engineers have been challenged to join forces and break glass ceilings in the transformation of the engineering profession for an all-round national development. This was expressed by a professor of aquatic toxicology, University of Ibadan, Professor Aino Adeogun, at the premises of the Faculty of Petroleum Engineering, University of Ibadan, on the occasion of the 2024 International Women's Day, organized by the Ibadan chapter of the Association of Professional Women Engineers of Nigeria, APWEN, a division of the Nigerian Society of Engineers. At the event with a the theme, Accelerating Equality Through Economic Empowerment, with scores of professional female engineers, female engineering students, and top management officials of the University of Ibadan, Lead City University Ibadan, and the Polytechnic Ibadan in attendance, Professor Adeogun said women should continue to lift other women to accelerate developmental equality. Nobody will solve Nigeria's problem for us. The Chinese had to come up with solving their problems. And when they were able to solve their internal problems, they are now marketing the solutions to the world. And now that we are beginning to realize that each gender has different strengths that we can harness, it is time for us to now come to a table where we are all standing on the same platform and complementing one another in finding solutions. In her address, the chairperson of the event and Commissioner for Women Affairs and Social Inclusion, Oyo State, Mrs. Tony Balogun, expressed a commitment to advancing the rights and opportunities for women community. The commissioner who was represented by the Director of Child Welfare, Minister of Women Affairs and Social Inclusion, Mr. Agbe Miliki Ojenide, said the journey for equality is a collective responsibility of all women, especially women professionals. I commend the Association of Professional Women Engineers for their tireless advocacy and dedication to breaking down barriers in the engineering field and beyond. Acknowledging the remarkable progress made in advancing gender equality so far in his address, the chief host and chairman of Nigerian Society of Engineers, NSC, Premier Branch Ibadan, Engineer Ibrahim Belu, represented by the vice chairman NSC by the branch, Engineer Ayokunu or Jedile, called for a need to break down barriers, challenge stereotypes, and strive for a world where every woman and girl can realize her full potential. They've started the awareness. And they want to maintain that equity. They want to, the idea of uh, being at home, uh, taking care of uh, husband, taking care of uh, children is over. They want to stand on their home and be equal to men. Helena Hadres, the host and chairman of the Ibada chapter, engineer Rahima Adabanija, said it is important for female engineers to champion equality, diversity, and inclusion towards empowering upcoming youths and young girls to embrace the field of engineering. Our female engineers can see that they need to be empowered, more empowered. We need to continue to develop ourselves. And also, we are bringing in the collegiate, hey, that is the student members of point. They are students from the various universities so that we catch them young and also involve them in our activities that they need to be empowered so that at the end of the day they will not be a back on all our activities. This um, program was very enlightening and eye-opening. Personally I really learned a lot and it was also a call to action for all of us who are female engineering students to always strive to um, achieve equity and equality, to go beyond inclusion at our different, in our different fields. Hapwen sees the occasion to call on leadership of the University of Ibadan, other higher institutions of learning and professional bodies to synergize for the advancement of engineering profession and technology in Nigeria. Benga Adeshui, reporting for Alore News.